This your boy, Atlantic City. And this time, we're going to take a look at Kevin Westerback's police interview. Now, a few things before I start with Mr. Kevin Westerback. It's hard to like any predator. But this guy is probably the only predator that I truly fucking hate. This guy sickens me. This guy sickens me more than the guy that wanted to perform a sex act with a cat. This guy sickens me more than John Canelli. I've never seen Westerbeck's police interview, so this is new to me. I'm not going to watch his his regular video, the, the To Catch a Predator part where he was featuring on the episode or whatever. I, I can't even get through it anymore. I hate this fucking guy. So, since I've never seen his police interview before, I'm going to take a look at that. Did you tell anybody that you were coming here today? Anybody that you know, did you call and tell them, hey, you know what, I'm going up to Dark yeah. County. I'm going to meet a female. I'm going for a drive. Anybody know that you're missing right now? No. Who do you live with? No, because nobody. Myself. Nobody so. fucking cares, Kevin. Friend. Nobody fucking cares. You have nobody to call. I really don't have a best friend. Okay. Who's the closest friend that you got that you'd call and tell, hey, I'm, I'm taking off? Did you call him? No, I didn't call anybody to him. I was moving crap all day to my parents' house and back, and I was tired. He just got out of jail, didn't he? Or did something hold up his release? Please tell me it did. And I got on to check email and she was asking. You know what, fuck that. I guess he did do his time. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, it's fine. What's going on? I said, I'm tired. I'm moving all day. She said, Please, I really want to see you. And I said, no, 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 no. And she was talking into it. I was going for a little bit, that's it. I'm too tired. Do you have anything you need to ask him? Yes. Do you know your license plate number on the vehicle you drove up here with? No, I don't. No? All right. Um, have you ever been married? Yes. Are you currently married? No. Divorced? Correct. Damn it, Kevin, you're a fucking snooze fest. <coughs> so this is this permission to search form. Basically, the search form is for your computer and your cell phone. Uh, and your 1996 Chevy Corsica. Uh, Did they find child I'm porn on his computer? It's okay that we get into your cell phone like you had already. Let me know. I don't know right. for sure if they did or not. I didn't really look into it or anything you know, like that, but I'm pretty sure he had something on there. Give us permission to search Let me just look car, at this fucking guy. Search and inventory are pretty much <clears> the same thing, okay? But what we're trying to get here is this, and also the possibility of searching and seizing your computer that you have at your residence. Do you understand that? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm going to give you the opportunity to sign this waiver. When we get to the sheriff's office, is, we take the handcuffs off. Is that the like same that. guy that did okay Robert Klein's video? Do you have any child on your computer that I'm going to Were they even no. in the same place? Okay. You're sure of that, right? Yes. Okay. Is there any other 13-year-old female's telephone numbers on the cell phone that you have up here? No. Thank you. <clears throat> is there any pornographic material or anything of, you know, Most criminal likely. nature in your vehicle? Drugs, knives, guns, bombs, no. sexual... Anything? No. Do you have any toys with you tonight? No. Did you bring any vibrators? No. Anything like this? No. Did you bring condoms? No. Okay. I don't want to go back and find that you have this stuff, and then we have to get you back out and talk about it. No. I'd much rather do it here. Be done. No. Okay. I don't have any of that. When we get back to the jail, we'll get you on handcuffed. I'll have you sign this form. You understand? Yes. Is there anything that you want to tell me? I apologize for the not tonight? talking that that much. But this is one boring motherfucker. Report. I was going to go back and I got to type a narrative report. Is there anything you want to tell me? Uh, probably stupid from coming out here. Probably. I should have just went on home until after she called me back and pleaded. Probably would imply there's another alternative. There's another option. 
No. Else. It wasn't probably smart. It was probably fucking stupid. Yeah. Yeah, it was probably stupid. <laughs> That's all I did. That's all it was the intent was. Okay. I didn't Anything else? Nothing with me. Nothing. Uh, just, <clears throat> hey, how you doing? You brought your dick with you, Kevin. That's all you needed. You know. You didn't need that little balloon thing. All you needed was your bare dick, Kevin. I'll see you later. You know, I'm going to jail. And considering you ain't chopped that little motherfucker I'm off before road. you got no. there, shows intent. You understand what I'm, uh, I mean by I that? I know exactly what you're saying. Yeah, he's been exactly through this before. Saying. That was not my intent. I learned my lesson the first time. Obviously not. <clears throat> Good one, cop. Right? Obviously not. Well, I wasn't coming You're chatting with the 13-year-old female about your penis size on the internet, and you drove Why would about you even want to bring that up, Kevin? to get here from New Lebanon to meet a 13-year-old female Lebanon. in the middle of the night. Lebanon. And you knew, Lebanon. by looking at the chats, her parents weren't home. <clears throat> Is that correct? That is correct. Okay. So you can't tell me you learned your lesson the last time, because if you did, you wouldn't put yourself in this situation. Well, a well, drug drug addict doesn't go back and put a mount of cocaine in front of him and say, I'm not going to snort cocaine. Well, I wasn't going to have any okay. sexual contact anywhere. Okay. That's the okay. difference. That's your story. They're not going to believe you, Kevin. That. I have a lot of evidence to prove that you were going to, you know, that you at least made an attempt to come up here and have sex with the minor. Do you understand that? I came up here to see her and say hi and not to have sex. Okay. Yeah, you know. All right. See, even they were disgusted by him. They didn't even want to give. They didn't want to even even get into it with him. Yeah, that is the same guy that did Robert Klein, huh? They didn't even want to get his guy six minutes worth of shit, man. They was like, get this fucking creep out of here. Step back towards the wall. Stand against the wall. Do you normally wear glasses? For reading. For reading. Okay. Yep, that's him from Robert Klein's. I like him. Look at the camera. They don't even have a fucking tripod for their shit. God damn! I mean, I'm not I'm not the guy to make short jokes. I'm not the tallest motherfucker, but Jesus, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not really going to go through all of this. <clears throat> I just wanted to see what he said to the cops. Wheeler? Wheeler, W O A W O H L. All those Windows XPs. And you're so sure. I'd still rather use XP than Windows 8, though, but it isn't about that. Let's see what we got here. Just skim through this because I really don't want to waste any more time on this fucking guy. So, There's those reading glasses. Five milligrams three times a day. What are you taking? What are you taking? O P A N. Okay. And that's uh, 0.5 milligrams three times a day. Fuck you. You get nothing. Okay. Okay. What's he on the floor? Oh, look at him. He's so cute. Well, what was the point of the other pictures? Look at him. There's your one phone call. That should be the thumbnail. Yeah, it doesn't really look like there's going to be anything else here, so... Well, that's that. That was a quick look at Kevin Westerbeck's police interview. It's your boy Atlantic City, and I'll catch you next time.